Hello everybody, welcome back to today's video. Today we are checking out how you can add permissions to your Bungie Cord permissions config file without using an external plugin. This is built into Bungie Cord. This uses for any Bungie Cord plugin requires Bungie Cord permissions, not per server permissions. So I wanted to make a tutorial on how you can set up these permissions. So pretty much what you have to do is you have to get into your Bungie Cord folder and then you'll locate your config.yml file. All you gotta do is double click this open and let's show you what to do. Your permissions will be listed underneath the permissions. By default, there will be a default and there will be a staff. I replace staff in this case, but I'll go ahead and just keep this here for now and I'll show you what we can do. There's one thing we have to notice before. Under groups, we have a username and the group name. So this is what you have to do to set it up. First, we're gonna create a group. In our case, we're just gonna name it YT test. Then anything you put after this dash here will be a permission. So if I do bungee cord, dot command dot find that is going to allow anybody under the group of yt test to use the find command inside of bungee cord you can add as many there as you want i did an example here under owner where it says i have all my bungee cord permissions plugins permissions located inside here then under groups what you have to do is you have to create you can either add a new username which in my case i will I'm going to add my username, noodles underscore YT, and I'm going to add myself to the group owner, and I'm going to add myself to the group YT test. You can add as many groups as you want. Then I'm going to go ahead and remove the default MD5. That's all you have to do. It's that simple to set up. Now, once you restart Bungie Cord, you will go ahead and join, and once you join into the server, you will have that permission in order to use it. Um... I'm not gonna show, I'll show it here. Give me one second to launch my Minecraft and I'll show you how this works. And there we go, I have joined our server which is located on my local host here. And I've gone ahead and typed in slash find and you can say you can see that I am now able to use the command successfully. To show you that's actually how it works, we, if we open up our config.yml again and remove the command find from yt test, save, and then if we restart, our Bungie Cord server, which I'll do right now. If I restart it and I join back on my Minecraft, you can you'll see I will no longer have the permission of YT Test or of Bungie Cord Find. So this is this is pretty simple if you're using limited a number of people who need Bungie Cord permissions. So now if I run Find Noodles, it will say you do not have permission. It's that simple to set up Bungie Cord permissions by default uh, without a plugin. Uh, if you want to use a plugin, I highly suggest Ultra Permissions, which will have a video coming out later this, within the next two weeks on how to set up Ultra Permissions for Bungie Cord. So that is that simple. It's just uh, entering the command in the file, entering the usernames you want to run that command, and starting up the server. If you need support on creating your Bungie Cord uh, server, we have a video on that. I'll leave it down in the description. It seemed to have like 700 views in, or 400 views in like a week. I don't know how that happened. I either someone decided to promote it or someone bought it. I don't know. Um, but I'm glad you, everybody seemed to enjoy that video. If you have questions on how to configure Bungie Cord or any of that, our Discord server is linked in the description, and I'll be happy to answer any questions left in the comment section of this video. If you want videos in the future, let me know what uh, video you would like to see, and I would be happy to um, release it here for you. Uh, if you have any questions again, let us know, and have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow for the next plugin tutorial or tutorial video. Goodbye.